let's select a point here, say store that position. You can either select points or polys. And uh, let's say I want to move that in to that position where I stored, where that point is stored. And we'll do that. And uh, no, please bounding box. So I'll move that just right here, which is nice. First point. I uh, have first point here. Let's try to take that one, select everything, do this over again, and we'll say first point and say OK. OK, cool. So, of course, I can also take this one, say stored. XY set, select all of these, and move stored. No, we'll go there. But uh, in this case, I think I want to select this point here first, and then use that as a position or as a reference. So, so you can do that. Rotate stored. So, okay, I can, for example, take this one and I'll say store that position here, this point. Take that one, say rotate stored. Now I can rotate it around the Y. So you can see, I can go like that. I can undo and works fine. What else? Well, I can also move this one over here. Well, let's just move it here. Actually, in this case, I'm going to use that plugin just to Let's see if I can move it based on two points. I'm not sure about that. So let's say store xy uh, set and take that one and move it into the position of the height of the bounding box. And yep. Does it work? Is it correct? I think so. Yeah, looks correct. Okay, so let's just move this like that. And uh, because my point here was to um, take this one, store the XY set position of that, and select this one again, say radial stored, and we'll use the what? We'll use the. Uh, that should be the uh, X position, I guess. Make seven clones. And there you go. So that's cool for uh, nuts and bolts and stuff. Um, one thing that, that I uh, had problems with though was um, I didn't really get the mirror function to work, unfortunately. So I can clone this one. I can store that X, Y, Z. Take this one. Now it should mirror it based on this position, but it doesn't really work. It just uh, places it in the same position. So I'm not really what's up with that. Ah, now it worked. Maybe I did something wrong. Okay. Okay, so I, I guess I pressed X, which I should not have done. 
maybe it should have been this set instead. Okay, yeah. So my mistake. Forget what I said. Uh, it works. So uh, these are very very good tools, and um, yeah, one more thing actually. You also got this uh, measure points, and uh, well, the measure the points, the distance here. So the distance between these are one meter in the set, and also one meter. But of course, if you use the diagonal diagonal, it's going to be longer. So very good plugin.